Welcome back. The place to make quality cheeses. No, we're not talking about Wisconsin, Mike and Dini. Yeah, Utah State University gaining a reputation as just that place. As Northern Utah Specialist Mike Anderson reports, right. there's good reason for that, too. They've been teaching cheese-making skills and curd-making skills for more than 100 years. It takes a certain amount of patience and skill to turn those curds and ways. Did you get it right this time? But then again, <laughs> this is not a class full of your average college students. How thick do you think the gel is? These guys are professionals in the industry. I brought our plant manager from Michigan as well as myself just so we can develop a greater foundation around cheese making. 921. Gary Weathorn, a vice president of manufacturing with the Dairy Farmers of America, says he wanted to get a better idea of what was going on in his factory. <laughs> he came here from Kansas. And as we did some uh, you know, reviews of what was available, this was the uh, first one up, so it was, came highly recommended. And that reputation has been building for a long time. The temperature on the fed is 95. As instructor Carl Brotherson will tell you. We're the best. <laughs> Brotherson says what he believes really draws people here is the fact that it's one of the most hands-on courses you can find. So we want people to come in here, play with the milk, get their hands wet, feel the curd. But he won't go quite so far to say it's the best course in the country. Uh, well, I better not go out on that limb. I'll get the <laughs> folks at Wisconsin mad at me. Even though it does draw people from all over. In Florida, we manufacture fresh uh, cheese. And uh, there are not many cheese making plants in Florida. Like Yuri Simon from Miami. I think I can learn a lot from here. The tradition of teaching cheese started here in 1895 and has continued to evolve over the past century. In about the last 10 years, there's been an increased interest in artisan cheese making. Which created a demand for this advanced course, whether it's from budding experts or industry executives. You like making cheese? Oh, I'm not sure. I mean, I love eating it. In Logan, Mike Anderson, KSL 5 News. Mike.